you're just joining please don't forget to give my video a thumbs up and sub subscribe to my channel yes you must okay no it's not a must it's not a must subscribe but please <laughs> subscribe to my channel so last week i know i was supposed to post a video because i decided i was going to be posting videos once in a week but life gets in the way like you can't control some things and i just didn't want to like you know overwhelm myself so i just decided you know i'll post this week so and i just thought you know after after a while i know i might be very very consistent but because i have a nine to five job i'm trying to like find out and balance my schedule so um i will be posting maybe as as time goes on i'll be posting twice in a week but i haven't really decided what days i will post so guys how was your valentine what did you guys do where did you go where did boo take you what did you guys do with family because i really i really i mean i think that valentine is not only about you know lovers i think it's about showing so much um um love to one another it doesn't have to be your partner it's just showing love to men so this video i'm gonna be you're gonna be getting ready with me as i put on my makeup for the day and you guys please don't don't just don't look at this i mean it's because i'm trying to you know make my hair sleek i have a ponytail that i'm gonna use at the end of the video you guys will be seeing that as well and if you want me to make a video about how to have a sleek ponytail and the ponytail you're going to be using please leave a, leave a comment below and i will make a video next time for that so um what did you guys do yes i want to know what did you guys do okay first of all i'm gonna prime with my um milk hydro grip primer when you see me on using a uh, shot uh, or a mini product it's because i'm trying to test out the product i i'm not gonna be wasting my money trying to buy um big products or buy the the big size and then i don't like it what's gonna happen i'm gonna actually i'm just gonna trash it so um i don't think i have actually done this before like i kind of like it when i do my makeup and i'm just quiet like people come in when i'm trying to do my makeup and then my mom or my my mom my sister they're talking to me and i'm like <laughs> like a dumb person like i can't talk or something but um this video i'm gonna try my best to actually uh you know get you guys along i actually saw something from jackie aina after priming I use this um, setting powder to actually set it in so that's what I do yes and so far so good it's been very 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 because I have a very very oily skin like not oily skin but oily face I have a dry skin but oily face so especially my t-zone area my chin my cheekbones so what I do is um, after priming whatever primer I use I then use it I use this and set it in like set it in don't worry you think it's gonna you, you're probably thinking okay no you know what your face is gonna be cakey ashy no 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 because guess what you're gonna put a foundation on it setting it in focusing on the places where i actually get um oily yeah that's the thing probably where i get oily and after that you see i know i look weird i know you don't have to tell me i do know so um then I use my uh, Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, stick foundation in Ebony. Ebony, yeah, it's Ebony. So what I do is I actually, um, you know, I kind of just drag it places. I don't put too much. I don't put too much. Then I could also, what I'll do, because it's kind of dry, I know that I should be using something that wouldn't make my skin oily, but there are ways you can work with it so instead of drying like i don't want it's, it i feel like it's kind of dry so what i do is i use the urban decay all nighter set it in like that then i'm gonna be mixing my foundation what i have on i'm gonna mix it with the fallible l'oreal foundation in and it actually is i mean has uh is a sunscreen birch spectrum 25 spf 25 in the shade what shade is this you know i've actually been using this foundation and i actually don't know what shade this is okay i think it's um 535 yeah 535 or 353 no it's 535 yeah so i'm gonna just pump oh, that's too much just have a little pump in there you know that should do mm-hmm so i use my concealer so i've been using this nyx bone to glow concealer just 
you know use it it's kind of more my skin tone i mean not exactly my skin tone maybe one shade lighter than my skin tone but um concealers that i use i make it i make sure i try to make sure that i brighten my under eye because dark circles you know it's really a problem for me i'm gonna wet my beauty blender and i just blend it in you probably will not see any any much difference like you see so if i was going for like a simple glam i'll probably just use this even if it's not really showing anything i'll probably just use this you see i just want to use it because i like it i'm gonna use it you see there is no um there's no i don't think there's any different in my face like my foundation and the under eye there's no difference so what what i do is i go in with my black upper found um foundation yes it's the foundation black upper foundation in the shade beautiful bronze let's go with this so as i was saying um guys uh please 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 um let's show love to mankind we shouldn't only we shouldn't show love to our partners or to mankind only on valentine's day we should show love consistently consistently like it's very very important because you know it's in the bible right love your neighbor as yourself i mean of course not more than yourself but as yourself so whatever kind of love you would want to get back from the world or you want to get back from people try and show love and don't expect anything don't expect anything from anybody if you're showing your support your love to people you probably won't get it back from the same person you'll be getting it back from somebody that you didn't even expect just let's not forget who we are as a person this is how I like my face you know with concealer not so much sometimes i might want to go overboard dab it in mm -hmm. just dab it in you dab you dab you dab you dab you dab you dab you know the funniest thing is before i actually started this video it didn't really take me time to like you know just get in conversation and start you know start recording before i would say so many things like so many things before i actually make a real video but this time around was different i, I think i'm getting comfortable i'm com getting comfortable with you guys which is a good thing it is a good thing so this is you know this is all prepped my skin my contour is all in my highlighter on in even if Mm, I might want to go in a little just to not, you know, pop it up a little. Yeah, just a little. Before I actually set it in, or whatever I used to set in, I use, I first for use the MAC Skin Finish, Mineralize Skin Finish in Dark Deep to actually, you know, put, just to avoid it being oily or whatsoever and still maintain that in my skin color. But sometimes I just go directly to my um, setting powder. But right now, I'm going to use this first, which is this beautiful thing here. I love this. I love it so much. Like, I just swipe. This is just, it's not, it's more like my skin color. You know, nothing too ashy, nothing too, not too extra. Not, I'm going to be using the uh, Seattle London Coconut Setting Powder. This is. I haven't tried it before. I don't think I've seen someone using this product, but um, like I said, it came in at the right time. So I'm gonna be using. I'm gonna pour some of this in here so that we don't take too much. Push, push, push. Push, 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 push. Push, 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 push. On my smile lines. Push. Push, push. So I take my Cover FX Monochromatic Blush Duo and I use this as my bronzer and my blush at the same time. So I just, you know, it has this beautiful color and you know this i like it's not too much on the skin, but you know, you could see, you can actually see it on the skin. I like this so much, and I just give you guys a big smile. And I just, you know, mm, 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 mm. 
You might not want to, you might not see anything now, but I can see something. And that's that's the most important thing. So you smile. I brush my brows and I kind of make some strokes. Strokes. Hmm. Yep, that's it. I'm gonna be using the Jackie I know palette, guys. So I'm gonna be using the Lituation situation. Lituation. <laughs> So I'm gonna be using this, the Lituation, this one here, and I just put it on my eyelid. That's it. You know, nothing to, like I said, we are not doing anything too much. You want us to be done? I think we are done. I think we are done. So now that I've done with the skin, I'm done with the skin, I'm done with the eyes, I'm done with the brows, I go back in to my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish, the product in, just to give it another, you know, I go into my um, my Malgani, the Anastasia Beverly Hills, and I just take a small brush for my nose, just to not to nothing hashy, but just you know. I just have an highlighter that was very very good and I actually wanted that would melt into my skin but I think the Juvia's Place um the Tribe Highlighter Volume 2 I think it's been doing some you know some little little magic that I've been you know liking but I don't like to do too much right I don't like to do just I put it this and I dab dab it off and I just you know um just I'm sorry just little yeah. I want you to see that glow. I just make sure that the product is all in, you know, no ash line. And that's it. And guys, this is the finished look. This is not the finish, but this is the skin finish look, if that makes sense. I just go in. No, nothing too much. Just go in and just. So, guys, I'm using this pony in here. This came in in a small, cute bag that I actually love. So that when you finish with it, you just put it back, like fold it back and put it in the bag. So this is the insert name here. This pony is what I've been using for a while now. Now, this pony, it's not a, it's not a real hair. It's kind of like a synthetic hair. So you kind of have to brush it out. You have to um put uh whatever it is you want to do. If you want to go for a messy look, I don't know. I've not tried it. I've not used any heating product or heating heating tool on this any straightener or whatever no i haven't used this on it what i just do to activate these coils i just um use um water and i use a leave-in conditioner and i just you know that's what i do so what i do is after you've done all of this after you've whatever it is if you want to make it in the middle it's good for it so i just and it's not expensive it's like maybe 40 dollars or so I, ca I can't remember I, I i think i bought it last year or last month so i use this it has a clip comes in a clip and it actually comes in um um something that you actually when you when it goes round, it's kind of like clipping it so what i do is i just take this clip and i just hook it in see that's it and then I just go around and just make it like a, like I'm wrapping the hair. So I'm wrapping the hair. So 
so I'm wrapping the hair and after wrapping usually I would use like um, spray or something to just you know make it more sleek but oh I, I can do away with this as well so this goes round this goes round so guys this is the hair this is the way it is and um yeah so now we're gonna go back to the lip and i haven't done anything for the lip so i'm using the kkw beauty lip liner in um nude three that's what I, this is good the only thing about this lip liner that i don't like is that is i think it's small for like the price it's just a little point in the inner area I, I was thinking maybe you kind of roll it but no it's not so what i do anyways that's that's just my only thing about this i like it and i i use it so what i do is um i just like line my lip and I think I did guys can you see how i mean it's kind of brown and i use the lip liner and i kind of like the brown vibe um i can see a smudge of the lip uh anything you want to do guys just use powder and guys are you feeling this look So guys, this is the look, and I use my setting spray. So guys, this is it. Okay guys, so this is my final look. If you guys want me to uh, make a video of how I achieved this um, ponytail, please leave it in the comment section below. And all the products that I used will be listed in the description box below. Please don't forget to give my video a thumbs up. Repost this video. Give my video a thumbs up. I'm saying that again. Repost this video. I'm saying that again. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. You're most welcome again. And I will see you guys next week. Bye. Ah.